this important European Resilience Forum has managed this year to gather in Athens experts and policymakers from 80 European cities. What I'm hoping from this uh, URESFO is to see how cities and how different practitioners and different experts are dealing with this new environment that is much more challenging and needs the focus on resilience and the focus on how we can really try to protect the most vulnerable at the same time that we build um, capacity in the cities to deal with this crisis. more uh, important to start talking again and again, talking how uh, cities can actually cope with crisis and how can actually build on resilience thinking. We used to work a lot for the citizens and that somehow transformed to working with the citizens and now a lot of adaptation is done by the citizens and that I think that's a, an important uh, development. What I really like is that you meet a lot of people that actually work in and with municipalities. So it's uh, the bottom-up approach that, that I like. You, you find the people who actually have experience in implementing projects on the ground that promote uh, sustainability and adaptation. Coming to URESFO is meeting uh, the people uh, who are working on climate adaptation around Europe and therefore uh, being able to network. The recognition of the growing agenda around resilience um, and a particularly important issue for cities across Europe, um, including in contexts where we see uh, uh, conflict and other forms of disasters happening.